Hello, welcome to Ye Learning for K Tinjian College School. Dear student, get your science book open to page 188. Should we start now? So the what we are come to talk about is what speed is. What is speed? So let's quickly read through and see what is speed. Speed, the distance covered by an object in given time is called speed. Repeat after me and also underline it in your book. The distance covered by an object in a given time is called speed, full stop. Shall we read it again? The distance covered by an object in a given time is called speed. Speed is measured in kilometers per hour. So this are symbol for kilometer and hour. One kilometer is equal to thousand meters an object that move a greater distance in the same amount of time has greater speed i will explain further if you move with a classmate from a given point in the school yard towards the main gate he who reaches the gate first has a greater speed. I will show you some diagram for you to know what we are talking about. But first, let's continue reading. Objects that cover different distance in the same amount of time have different speed. Let me show you the diagram before I continue. Okay, so let's look at the diagram. Let's take it like all these five people were in this line at the same time, at the same time, at the same place, and they started running. So which one is the first? This one is the first. So we say that this one has a greater word, speed. Okay, this one has what? The greater speed. The same applies to this one also. That is what we read that, for example, if you were walking with your classmates in a yard, and towards you guys working, the one who reaches the gate first is what? The greater what? The greater what? Speeder. So this is the example of it. Let's continue our reading. Cars are faster than bikes, bicycles. And bicycles are faster than a child walking. So now car and bicycles, which one is faster? Car, car is faster than bicycles. Okay, now bicycle and someone walking, which one is faster? Of course, bike is faster. Larger force cause an object to move with a great speed. Larger force cause an object to move with a great speed. Now we have a question. What is speed? Let's say it and write together. Okay, so let's read what is speed. Speed is the distance covered by an object in given time. I would like all of you to write it in your notebook, your science notebook. Let's look another example we have under the book.
Okay. So we have these four activities. This one is nail. This one is a woman walking or a girl walking. This one is a man riding a bicycle. And this one is a man going race with what? Walls. Okay. So now with this four activity, which one will have a great speeder? Which one will have a great speed? Okay. I hope you know the question. I want you to write the answer in your notebook. Okay. So dear loving students of grade 3B, this is the end of our today lesson. I hope to see you soon. Bye for now.